So the natural or non-supplemental ways of getting adequate vitamin D is, of course, from sun exposure. That's why it's called the sunshine vitamin D. And the obvious question is, how much sun exposure do you get? And, and how much can potentially cause damage? And the good news is that I've been working with a software engineer in California, and we've developed an app called dminder.info, D-M-I-N-D-E-R.info. And if you use it, it's free. It will actually tell you how much vitamin D you're making at, at any time of the day, anywhere on the globe, for any skin type. And it even gives you information when to get out of the sun so that you don't damage your skin. But that's the basic source. Then the only other natural source, of course, is oily fish, like salmon, mackerel, herring. Mushrooms exposed to sunlight or ultraviolet light will actually make vitamin D, so it's a good source. And cod liver oil, but that's basically it. They say that egg yolk is a good source of vitamin D. From my perspective, there's only about 20 to 40 units in an egg yolk. We think that you need at least 1,500 to 2,000 units a day for adults, so you'd have to eat a heck of a lot of egg yolks to get your vitamin D.